Hello and welcome to North Central. Today we're going to go through a quick tutorial on registering for classes for the upcoming semesters. What you're going to need to have on hand is you would have received admissions information once you've applied to the college. So you're going to want to take the email that you received with your admissions information um, and have that on hand. That has all of, um, has your username and password in it and we'll have some pretty important links that we'll reference a little bit later on. So once you've got that information on hand, what you're going to want to do is log into our main website, www.ncmich.edu. That'll take you to our main website. And once on our main website, you're going to go into our North Central portal, NC portal. Here is the link. Going into the link, you're going to take that username and password information in your admissions email and enter that here. I'm going to enter my information. And then I'm going to click login. <clears throat> That's going to take you into your portal, which you should see here. Your portal would look similar to mine. We're then going to go into my North Central, which my cursor is over now. And once in my North Central, we're going to go into the students tab up here, which is highlighted in yellow. And then we're ready to add or drop courses. I'm going into this link where my cursor is here. So once you are in add or drop courses, one thing, one important caveat to note is that you need to in that admissions letter that I referenced earlier, there is a link to your degree planner. So what your degree planner is going to do is it's going to give you specific information about the classes that you should be looking to choose according to your program of study. So that's going to be very specific to you and help you to choose those classes. So make sure you have that information on hand before going any further. Once you have that and have a good idea of the classes you're going to be ready to register for, you're going to go here and make sure that we're selecting the correct term that you want to register for classes. So as you can see, there's a full array of different selections, uh, the summer semester um, and different selections in there, uh, and then the fall semester. So if we're looking at the fall semester, we're looking at fall, the full semester of fall, and then we've got two accelerated semesters within the fall seven week semesters. One important note with these semesters is that there's only a certain select number of classes that are offered within the accelerated schedule. You can take a look at those by, by clicking on this um, to see what those, those classes are. But if you do want to want to finish classes at an accelerated rate, this may be an option for you. For the sake of time, we're going to just click into the fall full semester and begin to look at classes here. The simplest way for you to look at classes that you want to take is to look at the department line here, the select classes. So you can see all of the classes are listed here. And I, as an example, I'm just going to choose for the first one, communication. And then I'm going to click search. Now that we've searched, I have pulled up the complete list of all of the communication classes that are offered at North Central. One important note here is that North Central has three different campuses. We have our Petoskey campus, Gaylord campus, and Sheboygan campus. Make sure that you're selecting the correct campus or where you want to take classes. Okay, so as we look at, we're going to look at COM 111A. I'm going to just click into the course code here. And this is our course details. So this is going to give us all the information we need to know about when the class is offered, date, day and time, um, the, the dates that it's offered between. So this is the full semester you can see <coughs> and the location of the class. I referenced the references earlier. This one's on our main campus in Petoskey. There are others that are offered at Gaylord or Schweigen or also online. And then also it, this gives you the course description for this class. So this just gives you some general information about what the class has to offer you. Going back. 
and I'm just going to go back into communication, the full list of communication classes. So moving to the right on COM 111A, public, this is a public speaking course, tells you who the faculty member is, the seats that are open or in that it's an open class right now. That's important because if it's not open, you're not able to select it. When it's offered, Mo this class is offered Mondays, Wednesdays from 1 p.m. until 2.25 p.m. on our Petoskey campus. I'm just gonna scroll down really quick to show you some different examples. So you can see the COM 111E. This is a Gaylord class. This is offered on our Gaylord campus. And again, I mentioned online courses. If you're looking for online courses, you'd be looking for it listed as an online course. To select the class that you want added to your schedule, it's very simple. On the left-hand side, you see this box and it says add. You're just gonna click on add, and then you're gonna scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page and add the course, and that will automatically add the course to your class schedule. As another example, I want to show you real quick. We're going to take a look at a science course. So we're going to look at chemistry. And again, I'm just selecting chemistry, and then I'm doing a quick search. This is going to pull up all of our chemistry courses that are uh, offered at North Central. So we're again going to look at the top one here, Chem 101A. I'm going to click into the course code to show you something real quick. For Chem 101A, again, same details about course schedule, daytime it's offered, where it's offered, all of those things. One caveat to this is you can see here that this course has a prerequisite. What is a prerequisite? That means that this course requires you to have taken another course in order to be eligible to take this Chem course. Um, specific to this course, it requires you to have taken math 110 or higher in order to take chemistry. So make sure that when you're looking at all your classes, um, you're clicking in that course code and seeing if courses have any prerequisites that you need to have taken before you can select that class. So we're gonna go back to the main class list here. Again, chemistry, looking at all the chemistry classes offered and then moving to the right, same thing. This is an open class. You can see in the schedule here, this class is offered on Tuesdays and Thursdays. H means Thursdays on our class list, so make sure that you understand that. This class is offered from 1 p.m. until 2.25 p.m., Tuesdays and Thursdays. But you look down more, on Tuesdays, after that 2.25 in seat class, you're gonna go into your lab, and that lab starts after a little break from 3 p.m. until 5.55 p.m. So essentially, you'll be in class on Tuesdays for this class in particular, you'll be in class on Tuesdays from 1 to 2.25, little break, and then Tuesdays again, doing your lab from 3 until 5.55 p.m. Again, this course registration stuff can be a little bit confusing, so um, if you have questions or run into any problems, please feel free to contact us at Student Services. Our office hours are Mondays, Mondays through Fridays from 8.30 a.m. until 5 p.m. And our direct line to give us a call is 231-348-6605. Thanks again for listening and good luck with registering for classes.